Remember how we said Quentin was the father? <laughs> we lied. So you're saying you... Turkey basted myself with dragon semen. No big. I have a few thousand questions. Think of dragons as universal sperm donors. Makes for some really cool hybrids. My kid's gonna be epic. It sounds kind of dangerous. Do you have any idea how big it's gonna... Oh, no. This is a first. Historic. I suggest you back the fuck up. No one is taking my baby. Said the world's first true mama of dragon. So, you're Charlie, she... I guess she never met Kara. Kara? Uh, she owned a bakery outside of Chicago. Cupcakes. It was like something out of a storybook. She always smelled like peaches, and her smile was just... Michael and Lucifer, when they started their war, first thing a giant EMP or something like it went off over North America, fried every bit of technology, cell phones, power plants. For the first few days, we banded together, thought, hey, someone will save us. No one ever did. When the food ran out, people got mean. Mobs started forming, stealing whatever they could get their hands on. A lot of people died. Kara died. Yeah, especially since they came here with this deadly virus. Well, that explains the silk wood shower we just took. That was purely a precaution. There is no evidence that the biological agent they were transporting has been released. But we do have every reason to believe that there is an attack planned in the near future. What type of virus are we talking about? A weaponized strain of hemorrhagic fever. Basically causes you to start bleeding and never stop. And that's how the virus spreads, through contact with bodily fluids. It has an extremely short incubation period and a gruesome pathology. If not treated quickly, it has a 90% vitality rate. And if it's treated quickly? We believe that drops down to around 60%, but the bad news is... That's not the bad news? No. The bad news is there's only an experimental vaccine. We're flying ahead from Atlanta, but there's only a few hundred doses. Nowhere near enough to combat an outbreak. So, how are you guys doing? Uh, we're okay. Matt's still working at the car dealership. Still watches nothing but football. <laughs> I still have the boutique. Yeah, same old, same old. It's all very fine. Very Spring Valley, you mean. <laughs> Honestly, I'm really glad you're here. I needed a change, too. <gasps> Great idea, Matt. Now we're in a small room with no exits. What do we do now? I don't know. <gasps> Is that Becky? It's OK, baby. She's just napping. What? Forget binge watching this show. We're gonna binge make it. Hope none of you at home have to work, sleep, or feed anything for the next eight hours. It's a turnpike with no exits. Oh no! We can't riff six movies in a row. Our brains will melt. Our souls will implode. And what about our wedding? They got interrupted by a mechanical dragon. Still into me, I see. Oh, Jonah. Dear, sweet, simple Jonah, I've moved on. We all have. After you got eaten, King and I had our best talk ever. We realized everything had to change. And we hooked up. Ew. No, ew. no, 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 we did not. Things are just simpler online. Sometimes love is so strong the distance can be dead. You love something so much you'd rather not meet it. Awkward feelings are all proximity breeds. And our Wi-Fi's so good it's all that we need. So close and yet so far. That's the way is on wings you can't see we never met is it hot bet our, our love is on wings you can't see it's so so
But that's the only touch and we'll do 